বাংলাদেশ ন্যাশনাল ফুটবল টিম মালদ্বীপের উদ্দেশ্যে রওনা দিচ্ছে সাফ ফুটবল খেলার জন্য তো আমাদের আমরা আগামী কাল দুপুর দুটা চল্লিশ মিনিটে মালদ্বীপিয়ান এয়ারলাইন্সের ফ্লাইটে আমরা এখান থেকে যাত্রা শুরু করব এবং এটা আমাদের ডিরেক্ট ফ্লাইট এখান থেকে আমরা সরাসরি মালদ্বীপে যাব আর এখানে আমাদের হেড কোচ অস্কার ভুজান টিম ক্যাপ্টেন জামাল ভুঁয়া সেই সাথে আমাদের মিডিয়া অফিসার টিমের সাথে হাসান মাহমুদ উপস্থিত আছেন তো আমরা যাচ্ছি যে এক তারিখ থেকে যে খেলা শুরু হবে সেখানে আমাদের প্রাথমিক লক্ষ্যটাই থাকবে যে আমরা ফাইনালে অবতীর্ণ হওয়ার জন্য এবং ফাইনালে অবতীর্ণ হলে এটা আমি আশা করি যে এটা একটা ওপেন ম্যাচ থাকবে তখন সবাই ফাইনালের চ্যাম্পিয়নশিপের স্বপ্ন দেখবে যে এই ওপেন থাকুক এবং সেখানে আমাদের জয়লাভ করাটাই হচ্ছে আমাদের লক্ষ্য থাকবে এবং সে লক্ষ্য নিয়ে আমরা আমাদের কাজ শুরু করেছি প্রস্তুতি চলছে এবং এইসব বিষয় নিয়ে বিস্তারিত আমাদের কোচ আপনাদের কাছে উপস্থাপন করবেন এর পরবর্তীতে যদি আপনাদের কোনো প্রশ্ন থাকে সেটা অবশ্যই আপনাদেরকে করার জন্য অনুরোধ জানাব হ্যাঁ তো আমি এই পর্যায়ে আচ্ছা থ্যাংক ইউ Good afternoon. Um, regarding our preparation, team preparation, well, uh, we are going to have six days of practice to prepare for this big tournament, and I'm saying that in positive. So there are different ways to understand uh, one week is not enough, but for us it's more than enough. It's very clear that we are working very in detail in all the process, and the process is related to the game style and the moments of the game. Football is a complex game, so we are trying to work on all the principles and sub-principles that the, uh, the game will show when we are playing and trying to make, in short, trying to say it in short words, is trying to understand the new principles of the attack of the team, trying to understand the new principles and sub-principles of the defense of the team, the two critical moments of a game which are the both transitions attack defense and defense attack and also set pieces so as you see uh, there is a lot of work we have to do but i can say that after three days of practice uh, the most important is that the group of players and coaches we are in a perfect bonding and understanding we are pushing together to make it happen I cannot promise results or trophies, but I can promise that the boys are ready to start performing in a different way, implement a new idea, and the final idea is that slowly we get more interest together with your help. We want Bangladesh football to progress, to go to greater heights. Um, for doing that, now we need to show in South Tournament that we can beat all the teams of the region. So winning and results is one thing, but I would ask you to have some patience because we are very involved in the process and the confidence of everybody is very, very high. I say that in my first press conference, that is not only about a coach coming here to bring his ideas, it's about putting everybody together. Yesterday, for example, I have a talk with the president of the federation. Uh, all the officials of the Federation have been very supportive. We are having all the tools um, that we are requesting. And I repeat one more time, the most important is that the group is sticking together, the group is getting day by day a more clear idea of the game idea that we want, and they are fully convinced that this time we can click. So hoping for the best in the next half tournament. Thank you, Coach. Thank you, Coach. Now I would like to request our uh, captain, Mr. Jamal, here to say something about the next uh, competition. Good afternoon, everybody. 
So our next competition, as you all know, uh, South. So last few days, last last few practice sessions, we have been working very hard. Um, as Coach Manson mentioned, um, the players we want to do our best and we want to show that that we can do something in this tournament and hopefully we will do something in this tournament. Um, the players are. It's a, it's a good group and as coach said also we, we, we are confident that we can do something. Uh, of course our goal is to be the champion but we have to take one match at, at a time and then, and then we can and then hopefully we can reach the final but we are all confident that, that we, we will have some success in this tournament. Thank you. Thank you, Captain. Uh, now, the platform is yours. You can ask any question to the coach or manager or captain. Let's go. Jamal, you were telling that to win the trophy. But coach is telling not to win the trophy to play the good football. I think the coach want, also wants to win the trophy, but there's a process. So we have to trust the process, and then, you know, then, inshallah, then hopefully we can lift the trophy. But it's a process. Not if everything is done in one day. That is what he meant. So who, who is the main rival in your Main okay. rival? Your opponent, who is the main rival? The first team is Sri Lanka, so they are our main rival right now. Yeah, they are the first team we are playing. Favorite? Favorite, if you look at the rankings, of course, India is is highest rank. Mm -hmm. Jamal, No, uh, no. Of course, uh, fast, fast match. Uh, of course, it's like a crucial match. Our number, we can three point nil. Then, like a good start for this tournament. Um, second match, which is India, so we can not hurt the other ball. No, nah, we mentioned a group. We are like most of the players know each other, and most of the players have played with each other for a long time. So, I mean, as a group, we are very strong. As a group, we are very strong. Uh, so, as I said, I'm not easy confidence. I said that a group, I mean, No, of course, it's like the process. Uh, not everything is built in one day, so it's a process, but only when you of fast day join course, you act on both sides, you have to play a position, so he was very clear on the first day what he wanted from us players, and I think that is very important to know as a player what the coach actually actually want from a player. 
formation jamal ei saper pore to dorbodor khela league hm sobai taka paisa niche jar jar contract niche ei shomoy jodi keu injured hoy saper khelte je se to taka o pabe na khelte o pabe na tar monojog to divide ah rudol So, so he is he is asking like some of the players are afraid of getting injured in this soft cup because then they will not play in the league. Shall I take? Shall I take? Okay. Okay. Let's go point. Let's go. Sorry. Let's go point by point. I'm listening some of the things and I think we need to clarify some points uh, regarding your last question, Rubel. Uh, yesterday, President Hafa talked to me. I wanted to keep it first. The players need to know, but BFF is going to carry with all problems, therapies, wages, in case there is any injury. So the players and the clubs are in the safe side. This is a new measurement that yesterday the President announced to me, and now in one hour I will announce to the players. So the idea is that if we are on the pitch, we are going to die. We are going to give until our last. Uh, drop of sweat and blood, right? So this is one. Two, uh, I already listened that you are talking about playing, I don't know if you say positive or beautiful football. Uh, this is not like this. This is about efficiency. So if we think that defending and playing counter-attacks, we are going to win games, we could do that. But our idea is different. Our idea is that we think that we have good players, we are getting the best players of the BPL. We are playing against teams, teams with a ranking similar to us. So we are going to play to win. So you can call it beautiful, passing. You can put the SAR name that you want, but it's about efficiency. We want to win games. So the beautiful and the passing and all that is only a consequence of efficiency. So we have full trust that the players can step from the last performances, let's say 15 or 20 meters ahead, and we want to control the games, I say in the first day, we want to control the games in central areas and we want to be more sharp. So now the question is, what is being better in football? Being better is creating more chances than the opponent. I'm tired to say that during this year. So the ways you do it, you can find multiple combinations. You can be a defending team with counter-attacks, you can be a high pressure team trying to win the ball in higher part of the pitch or you can stay in central pockets trying to win the ball and create the chances. So I repeat what we want to do in this tournament apart from the results you say that I don't want results no, no, we are targeting the tournament Jamal say very clear that if we play this tournament is to win but that is very big words we need to be confident on the process, on the things that we are doing day by day on the ideas, on the confidence of the players. We need to give them tools. We need to offer service to them to build their game. And we are fully confident one more time. And we have a strong self-belief that this is a good moment to try to change. And let's see if it clicks or no. It's very difficult. This is what I say, that it's very difficult that in one week everything clicks. A team usually to get major needs six or eight weeks. So we are having one. So what we are trying to do is brief. I told you before that in football there are five different situations of moments. We need to understand very well how to attack. We need to understand very well how to defend. And what is most important always because of the speed, and I think that in the subcontinent it makes a big difference, is the transitions. So the moment we win the ball and the moment we lose the ball. Now we have four moments. If we add the set pieces, so it's very, very complex. I'm talking about five different moments and we only have six practices to go deep into that. So we will go as deep 
as we can and the reception, the, how the players are digesting all the information is really fast. So apart from doing the daily practices in Bongo Bondu, every morning we are having a meeting. I didn't start uh, yet with videos. So what I cannot do is giving an overload of information because when you overload information, you are going to forget about the basics. So from the basic principles, we will go slowly, we will uh, break them down, we will go to certain sub-principles and try to cover as much information as we can. But in our side, the confidence is huge that this is a moment that we like this competition. We take it as a nice challenge and let's see how far or how close we are from the best teams of, of, the, of the South continent. Uh, same question as Rubel, you are asking who is the best team or what is the most important game or who is our rival and the answer of Jamal was perfect. Uh, right now all efforts, all mine, all analysis uh, is in Sri Lanka. So if we can beat Sri Lanka then we are going to have our first final against India. And if we cannot beat in Sri Lanka then we are going to start with a deficit of points because the next rivals are going to be tougher. So I don't know the road to the till the end. It's going to be a very long road. Four games is a lot. So best for us is focusing on our daily practices, focusing on the process, and try to get the points with Sri Lanka. Because if we start winning, I think that our chances will multiply. Uh, again, these calculations are at the end of the round robin and the, at the end of the league. I say the first day, our rivals in, in FIFA rankings, uh, the games that we should target the most are Maldives and uh, Nepal. Yeah. In, in terms of points, uh, I, wish, I wish we can get eight points, minimum. No, 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 no. If two teams, if two teams points is equal at that time, what do we have? Uh, I think it's the same format as always. Uh, first is goal difference, and in case the goal difference is the same, then they will count the goals in favor. First is head to head. Yeah, of course, of course, of course. Uh, we will have this news. Uh, we are trying to do everything. So the news about Kingsley. Please, let's respect the group of 26 players and uh, we don't even f have finalized the final list of 23. That will come after today's practice. So all players will attend the practice today. We need to clarify a couple of points and after the practice we will take the final decision about the list of 23. And regarding Kings, it's going to depend on the, on the clearance. You are not announcing the final list now? How can I announce a list now if I have practice in two hours with 26 players? That would be really, sorry, sorry, 27 players. That would be really disrespectful, but honestly, uh, the list is still not finished. We still have one or two doubts. No need to say the full list. just say four players now. Yes, but I respect the 27 players, so for doing this, we will do after our team practice. Otherwise, I can say now and I can send them home. They don't need to come to the practice. So all players are ready today. The practice today, actually, there is a lot of content. There is a lot of intensity. And as I say, we still need to clarify a couple of things to decide the final list. Not at all. This is my work. Beautiful, and I take it. You can ask the players that I assume it, and I take it. If it's not clicking, all the responsible should go to me, because that means that what I try to implement with the group was not working. But I think we are going to play in a different way. I think that we are going to call the attraction. Games are going to be on TV. Uh, slowly, you are coming more people here to the press conference. The, all the parts of the federation are in place. So tension, not at all. I'm living in a fairy tale. I think that being with the national team is something that I say the first day is a blessing from from God that I had the opportunity to defend this beautiful country that is hosting me for the last three years. So for me it's pleasure, not pressure.
Well, I can say a lot of things about that. Yes, one of the reasons I think why BFF hired my services for soft tournament is because of my experience in these countries that you have mentioned. So we can talk about different levels, about players, about game style, about pictures, about infrastructure, about the quality of the league. There is a lot talk very, very long, but I want to brief it. Uh, I had the opportunity to work in my clubs with the three captains of the three big nations, and I stick with our captain. Uh, in the past, I worked with Sunil. In the past, I worked with Ali Asfak, with Dagay. Uh, and now I'm working with our captain, Jamal. So I want Jamal to be the leader. And yeah, it's about big figures of, the, of, of all this part of the world. And there are completely different players, but there are three leaders. And I hope that now Jamal take the, together with us, uh, help us to take the team to to the level that we are requiring. I have a question for uh, Is it actually challenging to play in uh, Maldives uh, than the other brown team subcontinent? Um, Yes, it is. It's challenging for all of us, especially when the players, uh, they gave everything for the former coach. So it's always bad news for a group of players when you change the coach. They were quite attached to him. We are bringing our new ideas. It's going to be very challenging. It's going to be very tough. But again, this is about mental toughness. So the belief of us in the team, the belief of the players in the team, and the belief of BFF, BFF on the team are all, all aligned. So that is a big reason of satisfaction and to keep our confidence that what we are doing is right. So then you will, I know that you are going to evalu evaluate our work just because of our results. We are not going to do that. We are talking, as you see, I'm talking a lot about the process. So the process means the game idea, the game philosophy, what Bangladesh want to do in the future, how you want to play football. Uh, in the first day also we talk about the list of players and coming from the best teams. So Bangladesh, I don't want to see this Bang uh, Bangladesh team defending, containing, speculating and just waiting for the number of goals that they are going to receive. We want to there, we want to be brave. So the best opportunity for do that is ahead of us. Let's see how far we can go. I repeat the same things. Maybe I can come into the pitch and help. <laughs> so that is one solution. Uh, talking seriously, uh, I'm also a little bit tired of this. It's the same thing as the passing. Uh, there is a negative. There is a negative tendency and talk about the Bengali players that they cannot pass, they cannot build up, they cannot attach to one system. They cannot score. For me, all that is not true. Uh, what is true is that we don't have a very well-defined number nine. So a box player, a player that in one touch, finish. This in the league is the responsibility is usually given to the foreigners. Say that uh, if you are asking how we are going to score, I think the answer is very simple. Uh, in our team, all players are going to attack and all players are going to defend. So if you see the performances, 
of the last games, you see a Bangladesh team more focused on defense and the attacking um, the attacking instructions were given to just a few players. Uh, right now, we are trying to change this. So what I'm trying to say is that, for example, if you don't have a positional number nine and you have a mobile one, let's give the responsibility to score to the second line of attack. And I think that the characteristics of the Bangladeshi players totally fit for a second line of attack. Sharp, vertical, fast, quick in the transitions. So these are the positive points of the Bengali players because we are always talking about how bad or what are the problems or what, what are the weaknesses and I hope that one day you change and start talking about what are the strengths of the Bengali players and I can assure you that there are a lot. So in terms of uh, scoring goals, uh, let's give the responsibility to all of them, even to the defenders. I say before about the five moments of the game. So set pieces is going to be another factor that we need to take care of because even the defenders can score in set pieces. So if you are trying to find who is going to score the goal, so who is going to be the striker, you are not going to have my answer on this sense. Last round, last round. Okay, no more. Okay. সেই সিদ্ধান্তটা আমাদের আজকে ট্রেনিংয়ের পরেই নেওয়া হবে আপনারা এর পরেই অবগত হবেন এই বিষয়টা তারা জানাবে যে কোনো সময় সেরকম একটা অবস্থানে আছে এবং এরপরে আমাদের হয়তো ন্যাশনাল টিমস কমিটি বা আমাদের বিএফ এফ প্রেসিডেন্ট এবং কোচের যে ফিডব্যাক সব কিছু নিয়েই আপনার হয়তো পরবর্তীতে আর বসে এটা সিদ্ধান্ত জানাবে না কোচের যে লাস্ট ট্রেনিংটা শেষ না হওয়া পর্যন্ত উনি টিম ঘোষণা করতে চাচ্ছে না যেহেতু টিমের একটা ঘোষণার ক্ষেত্রে যেহেতু একটা প্র্যাকটিস সেশন আছে কোচ সেই সময়টুকু নিতে চেয়েছেন আমরাও সেই সময়টুকু তাকে দিতে চাচ্ছি মাঠের ভিতরে তো আপনাদের হয়তো ওই জায়গাটা না আপনারা এমনি তো মাঠে যাচ্ছেন আপনারা প্রতিদিনই কোচ যখন দেবেন তারপর পরে আপনাদের What is the difference between 27 and 23? You just said that this four player will be eliminated. Then I mentioned another thing. Go, Rupert. We have to say that the team is going to be a COVID test. We have to do the test. This is a factor that we have to do. We have to do the test. 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 যদি সেক্ষেত্রে আজকে আসলো না আমরা ধরে নিলাম